they can continue on, continue on from where he left off in Australia. Well, you see, there's a fielder down there. That was all part of a little plot by Chit and Sharma to drop one in short, get a miss hook and a catch. It's capital Dev at deep square. Short and Desmond in position and rolling the wrist down on top of that one. <laughs> Appeal for LBW, but Greenwich well outside the line of off stump there. Chairman, Greenwich padding up to this one. Uh, wide outside the off stump. Seven for no wicket after two overs. Desmond Haynes, another international player who averages 40. Oh, beautifully bowled. Such a good line. And this was a, a lovely ball here from Capital Deb to Desmond Haynes and just move. That's in the air, but between them. Wonderful shot. Always under control. Very positive move by Gordon Greenwich. Chit and Charm, it wasn't all that short, but Greenwich was inside very quick and, and turned, hooked it off his hip in between the two feelers. That's in the air. And he dropped it. Oh dear, that was the plan, and the plan all but worked, and Greenwich lives to tell the tale with three runs. And Ashad Ayub is saying it swerved, it swung. I was under it, but I was never under it. Well, Sidon Charma has set up Greenwich, and the plan came off. Greenwich hooking it down to deep backwards square. And the feeler ran, moves around, got himself into position. And he's circling, circling under it got right under the ball, still waiting on it, waiting a long, long time for it to come down. And there you see it, in and out. Rolling to Gordon Greenwich. Wonderful shot. What more can you say? Oh, it was a beautiful shot. there to Greenwich and oh what a lovely shot right down on top of it and cutting it through between point and gully and there's four more not a bad ball a couple there Greenwich getting a little movement and Greenwich opening the face of the bat really and, and running it past third slip and there's a chase here with no chance of cutting that one off Ooh. that's a cracking shot that's gone through mid wicket no fielders there i think rather a lame attempt to repeat his bouncer trap Term. Again, not very short, but when it's a magnificent shot inside, pulling it, giving it the full treatment. Oh, that's not a bad shout. A big stretch by Gordon Greenwich, and he'd be faintly annoyed by the shout, but the ball was drifting in. 
hidden Sharma into Greenwich and it's always a very serious thing to do this to pad up to the ball coming back without offering a shot but he's just outside our stuff and the big crowd here is enjoying this challenge between Greenwich and Chama. West Indies 37 without loss his hands and strike Sharma bowls that's a good ball Sharma has bowled very well here at Kensington Oval and Gary this one from Sharma just cutting back and taking a, a thick inside edge and flicking onto the pads Oh, that's well taken indeed by Kieran Moray. Very neat, nimble keeper. I have two Greenwich. Oh, wonderful shot. Really good shot. Poor Ayub. He's the man who dropped Gordon Greenwich earlier on. And he must think that Greenwich has something in for him today. He will fly it from Ashad Gordon Greenwich coming down the wicket. And hits it very well over bowler's head. Beautifully placed. What a wonderful shot. Sidhu from long on. This well pitched up to Greenwich. He comes forward, leans over it. Good play, beautifully. West Indies 62 for no wicket. It's a very good ball indeed, coming back off the seam. And although Haynes can fairly claim to have been outside off stump and quite a long way, it's a dangerous occupation padding up without playing a stroke. Yeah, it's outside the off stump. Haynes coming forward, but hitting very high on the pad. That's swung away by Desmond Haynes. First bounce, a little roll, and that's four runs. Very good shot. Well pitched up from a on leg in middle. It's coming forward and lifting in high over mid wicket. Gordon Greenwich, 41, not out. Chetan Sharma, the bowler. little Indian theatre there for you. The ball did come back sharply, but Greenwich well outside of stump. Yeah, well pitched up outside of stump. Gordon coming forward, offering no score. That's in the air, but it's safe. Not a very successful sweep shot by Gordon Greenwich, but it brings him two runs. And there's which Richardson who got 194 in Diana. Shastri, first ball. And he's given out. Yes, he is. Out caught off bat and pad. And that is the end of Desmond Haynes. First ball from Shastri. Well pitched up from Shastri coming in with the arm. Taking the inside edge, hitting high on the pad and going to Sanjay Majega feeling a power shot leg. So 
So one wicket down for 84 runs, the West Indies. India 321 in their first innings. Coming in now at the fall of the first wicket. This is a ground which he likes very much. Has 2,895 runs in his 42 tests. 69 innings has been not out on six occasions. Shastri bowls to him. First ball, a defensive shot from the new batsman. Richardson getting off the mark. Now the Oxing Sidhu giving chase, but Richardson completing the second run quite comfortably. Ayub. Greenwich. Bringing up his 50 with a single just backward of square. Gordon Greenwich, a half century at Kensington Oval, appreciated by the crowd. When it is 50, included five fours, came off 85 balls. Pleasant off drive, and the single is on. 93 for one, the West Indies. A good crowd at Kensington Oval for the second day, bigger than the first day's crowd, but still not by any means a capacity crowd at Kensington Oval. Fairly large number of tourists joining Barbadians and other West Indians to witness this match. Gordon Greenwich in the red cap and Richard Richardson will resume the innings for the West Indies. Greenwich is on 54 and Richardson is on 3. wicked aware there so Gary it really yeah. was a ball which might very well have left alone I mean it would most certainly have been called a dead ball by the umpire yeah, yeah, because it, it slipped out his hand pulled it right down it bounced about three times Richardson is trying to hit it with all the parts of the cover and mistimed the ball hit the inside edge and luckily for him it fly past the leg stump so a lucky break there for Richardson well, Seymour Nurse must have been very concerned uh, there when Richardson played that shot. <laughs> Richardson facing Ayu. That's this one down backward of square. There's Hirwani doing the fielding. And that's Richardson's first run since T. 100 for 1, the West Indies. Haynes out for 27, Greenwich on 59, Richardson on 4. Worth a shout. Beating leg stumps to Gary. The other one was pushed through a little bit quicker and it was just going down. And see here, pushed through a little quicker and Greenwich was beaten for pace but it's going down the leg side. And there's Gordon Greenwich just clearing the head of the mid on fielder and getting this one down to the boundary for four. But Sagari not quite in control there, didn't get hold of it as well as he would have wished. Yes, well, Shastri just gave that one a little bit more air and took, a little, took the weight off for it. As you can see here, Shastri trying that one a little bit higher, Greenwich getting, not getting right out to it and mistiming it. 107 for one, West Indies, India 321 in their first innings. Arshad Ayub in his 10th over, none for 37 before this over. And Greenwich really looking to 
pull that one away very hard. This one from Ayub was flighted a little bit from outside the off stump and Gwyn is looking for that sweep shot from outside the off stump. So the batsman are mistiming some of the balls and the shots. Yes, he gives it the full treatment. It's over long on. Not quite off the middle, I don't think. And it, in the end, trickled for four, but still it was a positive shot. Cleared the infield. Four more to Gordon Greenwich. Oh, well, and throwing this one higher up, and Greenwich come into it, moving his feet very well, hitting it, but didn't time it well, but enough to get it over the fielders. shot he shaped it he knew exactly where it was going and it went there quickly and that was a lovely shot beautiful shot well timed and Richards Richardson does this all the time cast free flight in it Richardson coming down right to the pitch of it and a beautiful cover drive straight through the covers a sense to chase that one That's in the air, but it's square, and it's going to be Chastry, and that's four runs. It was uh, a long hop, and I think everyone recognized that. Hirani dropping this one short, and Greenwich into position very quick, and pulling it away backwards the square. And the ball, see there, running away to the boundary. Greenwich now is 76 facing Hirani. Nicely placed. And West Indies 129 for one. Another good shot. He puts a little bit of right hand into it, but only to steer and punch. And when the ball goes off Richardson's bat, it really flies. You can see here again as Shaftesbury coming again, try to that uh, Richardson down again, right on top of it, and straight through between mid off and cover. Frank Longhop, proper treatment, six runs, square leg. They love it. Well, that was a stroke of luck. Gordon Greenwich aiming through mid-wicket and it went out to cover square on the offside. So this one really flighted and Greenwich is looking to hit it through the onside. another short one badly bowled by Shastri and you simply can't go that way to a player of Greenwich's talent and this this one from Shastri drops short again and Greenwich in position again and oh hitting it very very hard away through the mid wicket super shot there's just no way that you, you expect a ball to lots of close fielders clustered around the bat and that's the reason why just look at Gordon Greenwich in full flow 94 runs he's got now lovely shot here Hawani and Greenwich giving himself room and just dabbing it coming down on top of it and playing that late late cut Overthrows in this. So Richardson <laughs> takes up two. Would it be three? It was overthrown the next time by Sidhu. Yes, it's through. But just for two.
One wicket down for 159. Very strong position indeed. That's beautifully placed. That big bat of Richardson's resounding. So they take two. There it is. Richardson with the on drive. Very well played. Feet in the right position. There it is. A little nudge for the onside, and the bat goes high in the air. Gordon Greenwich has done it. Acclaimed by everyone in the stadium here, not least by the man on my right-hand side, Sylvester. Well, it certainly is a very well-deserved hundred, and it brings in some financial reward as well. Gordon Greenwich, his previous highest score in a test at Kensington Oval, 80 runs, and at the moment he's long been waiting for. Here is how he's done it. It was a nice little nudge. Well flighted delivery from Hirwani and played away into the mid-wicket area. And Gordon Greenwich in two test series has achieved the landmarks which have previously evaded him. First the test century in Australia. he can appeal against that if he likes on the grounds of brutality upish and that's the place to bow This is a shot of a length ball outside the off stone, well flighted, Gordon going back and just wanted to run it down. Third man, just wide of couple there, feeling it slip. That's another Greenwich boundary. Pitched upon the legs and flicked away, high over square leg. Short enough for Greenwich to get back and pull this one between the man down at long on and the mid-wicket. And uh, Sidhu had just been shifted a bit to the right. There it is, Rowani, short, and Greenwich back, and pulling it through mid-wicket, four runs, good shot. So, 200 for one on the scoreboard of the West Indies. India scored 321, so the West Indies at this point are 121 behind. Short ball from Sherman. Greenwich hits it high in the air. He's going to be out. He is out. Sidhu takes the catch, or rather, Hirwani takes the catch, and Greenwich goes. Gordon Greenwich, out caught by Hirwani, off the bowling of Chetan Sharma for 117, a well-played innings, but he's disappointed. There it is again. Short ball from Chetan, outside the off stump, and he wanted to pull it over mid-wicket and top-edged it. Hirwani running backward to about 10-15 yards and taking the fine catch. So the West Indies are now 201 for 2 in the 55th over. Keith Arthur 